so to start off with this makeup look I'm already done my base makeup and my eyebrows and um, I primed my eyelids with some concealer so we're gonna jump right into the tutorial I'm using my Coastal Scents 88 color eyeshadow palette it's really old I've had it forever <laughs> used it in a while so I decided to pull it out for today's look to start off I'm going to be going in with this with this gorgeous blue color right here it's like the perfect royal blue color and as you can see I did drop it and it cracked in half <laughs> but it's still usable so going in with that color I'm just going to pack that onto my eyelid, no higher than the crease. It has a little bit of fallout, but I'm not going to fuss too much about that. And then what we're going to do is pull it to the bottom lash line. So the next thing that we're going to do is, we're going to darken this up a little bit, we're going to give it some drama. To do that, we're going to need a brush that's a little more fluffy. This one has an angle on it, but yours doesn't have to, it's just the one that's available to me right now. Um, I'm going to be going in with this dark purple color, very light hand, because this can go from 0 to 100 very quickly with a very light hand. I just want to brush this purple into the crease. And just so you know that we're not going for a purple look here. We're just using this purple to deepen up the blue that we started with. So then we're going to mix the purple and the blue together now. More blue than purple. And pat that more onto the eyelid, just darkening it up and making it a little more opaque. Try to concentrate most of the color along the lash line so that you get kind of a gradient smoky effect. With whatever is on the brush, we're just going to drag it down onto the bottom lash line. this brush here and get rid of all that fallout Wonderful. and then I'm gonna go in with this super shock shadow from Colourpop it's called Blaze and it's this great beautiful golden bronzy color Let's see how the fingertip goes So I'm gonna use I'm gonna use my pinky and go in with that in the inner corner to bring some light in. And then just drag it onto the lid a little bit. And then next I'm going to take this Sephora, um, it's in the color Meteor Shower, and I'm going to pick up this very pretty gold color in the center, and just overlay that gold that we put in. 
I don't think I want to do liner today, so we're going to skip that part and go right on to mascara. And the lashes that I'm going to be using are these lashes from, N from NYX called On The Fringe. Okay, lashes on. Uh, they're kind of a lot, but I'm going to work with it anyways. Um, let's get the rest of the face done. But before we go ahead and do that, I'm just going to clean up my edges a little bit with some concealer. Next thing that we're going to do is blush. So I'm using my Glamorous Blush Palette from BH. And I think I'm going to stay peachy with the rest of, with the rest of this look. So we're going to go in with this pretty peachy pink. I'm gonna stay in this palette and use this blush. It's really pretty. It's an iridescent kind of um, peach color. So I'm gonna use that as my highlight. And finally for the lips, I'm going to be using, well first I'm going to start by lining my lips with this dark brown color from Annabelle. Then I'm going to use this slightly lighter brown color from MAC, it's called Cork. I'm going to use that to fill in the rest of my lips. And then for my lip color, I'm going to be using this beautiful peachy pink lipstick. It's from Dose of Colors and it's called Angelic. Okay, you guys, and that is it for this look. I want to thank you so much for watching. And if you like this video, be sure to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss anything in the future. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.